you know. Jody Magnet. Hello, listeners, and thank you for listening to Barely There Theater. Apologies that it's been so long without an episode. This podcast is what I do for fun in my free time, and the last several months of my life ate any free time I had, so I haven't been able to work on anything since the last episode came out in August. My plan going forward is to have a slower release schedule that is more manageable for me and more consistent for you, the audience. Uh, Instead of releasing a play every month, I will be releasing an audio play every other month starting in February of 2023. I love doing this. I love writing, editing, and working with actors on scripts. Uh, Trying to do all those things all of the time, however, has worn me out to the point where it isn't fun anymore, just stressful. Which is not the place I want to be when I'm working on this. So, to lighten the pressure I'm putting on myself, I will not be writing anything for the next season of Barely There Theater. There may be some original pieces in 2024, but for this coming year, I'm just going to focus on adaptations of older works of literature in the public domain. So instead of writing and editing and directing, I'll just be directing, editing, and (laughs) editing. But I'm excited for what I picked out for next year, as I think there's a fun range of pieces and styles and genres that you'll be able to enjoy from the comfort of your speakers or headphones, or if you're in your car, or however it is you listen to Barely There Theater. So without further ado, here's the 2023 season. Starting in February, we will be staging Macbeth by William Shakespeare. Then, in April, Swan Song by Anton Chekhov. In June, Trifles by Susan Glassbell. In August, Moby Dick by Herman Melville. In October, The Wasteland, a radio play version of the infamous poem by T.S. Eliot. And finally, in December, A Christmas Carol by Charles Dickens. Rehearsals will still be released in the weeks following a play's premiere, so those of you who enjoy the process can still listen along. I can't wait to get to work on these plays, and I can't wait for you all to hear what comes next. Thanks for listening.